Isn't it just awesome to open the trunk of your car and see this? If that's not sexy, I don't know what is. Okay, enough of the epic music cinematic nonsense already. This is my Leshy 2 with a new Trilog Behemoth Moderator by Edgun. And before we get down to business showing the Skyrats what a huge mistake they've made trespassing on my permission, we've prepared a brief tutorial on how to install the Leshy 2 kit of this terrific noise suppression system. Who doesn't want their kit to be as quiet as possible? I give to you the new Leshy 2 Behemoth kit by Edgun. Okay, the full behemoth kit comes with four chambers. As you can see, the caliber is indicated on them. That's 6.35 mm or 25 cal. An adapter, a hand grip, an end cap, again with the caliber indicated on it. You got a tri leg adapter and you will see in a bit how easy it is to install your suppressor on your gun with it. Some bolts are included in the kit, of course. And with your new suppressor, you'll also be needing a longer pin lock. First, let's remove the stock moderator. You need a 4mm Allen key for this. Now let's slip the stock moderator of the barrel. Now let's put the adapter into place. Time to install the handguard now. The other four bolts go in from the side. Not too tight, guys. The trilog adapter goes in like so, and be careful, guys, because there is a thread and there are also o rings on the inside. The adapter is already in place, and as you can see, it's flush with the handguard. It's time to put the very suppressor together. You can put as many chambers as you like, depending on the sound level you would require and the compactness of your gun. Initially, I think I'll try all four chambers on. And the end cap. Now let me show you how quick and easy you put it on the barrel of your gun. This is one of the major perks of this suppression system. This is the tri-lug adapter. Much easier to install the very suppressor on it than to screw in on a half an inch UNF thread. This line serves as a reference point so that you always know how to install your tri -leg suppressor. With me it always comes on the right side of the gun. Like so. The line is on the right, then you just twist it and you're done. And I know the gun is a bit long now, but let's see how quiet it is. Very good. The last thing you need to do is replace your pin lock with the longer one included in the kit. In order to do so, you have to take out the pin in this hole right here. You apply some pressure or if you have to, you just tap gently on the pin remover. There you go. The difference in length is not considerable, but it still matters. We put it back in the same way and we're done. Now just a quick test to see if it locks into place. Perfect.
It's getting really exciting. I'm about to score the first kill for the day. Okay. Some hold on there. It's a pretty steep incline. Ooh, a hard landing, good. Okay, that was first blood for the Leshy and the Behemoth. There were a lot inside, and this one is going to remain up there, obviously. Look at this. Yeah, you necrophiliac, you had it coming. That's two pigeons lying right next to each other. I wonder when the seagulls are going to spot them. I had to briefly stop shooting at the silos. Yeah, they're loading a truck and they asked me to go to the other part of the complex for a second so I went to those tin sheds that the pigeon loves so much to perch on yeah so those two that I just shot were at about 25 26 yards I think it's gonna take a while before they get the courage to land on them again but some of them did get the courage to go inside let me show you yes right up there let me get my leshy okay that's the one that's gonna get it. Oh, straight down. Five yards, we got some elevation, wind coming from the right. Just as I expected, apparently these birds are gonna make me go back and forth today. Shoot one at the silos, they go to the opposite part of the complex. Shoot one at the tin sheds, they're gonna go back to the silos. Now with this one, which is at about 57 yards, I'm going to adjust full wind a bit to the left yeah that's where the wind is coming from let's go again Another customer at about 44 yards. Good. I almost forgot about the pigeon that I shot indoors. Oh, look at him. Look at his foot. 
Yeah, nasty creatures. 55 yards, hold under duty incline. Got him. Beautiful, isn't it? Something weird is going on today. This is the first pigeon that I shot and it's been lying here for almost an hour now. Oh, look at all the grain that's been spilled. Oh, and the graphic images too. But anyways, my point is I haven't seen any of my feline friends yet. And while I collect some of my catch, look up. How stupid are you? Okay, I'm back at the position where my leshy is. Just let me set these down, put some hand sanitizer on my hands and I'm gonna get the newcomers. A young bird at 55 yards. Wind from the right again. Hold under. Straight down. Only 30 seconds later, they're back at the same spot. I think I'm shooting at young and inexperienced birds. Another one. Oh, hard landing. And some more at almost the same spot. So I imagine this should be, I don't know, 57, 58 yards. I'm gonna have to be honest with you guys, I didn't measure the distance with my rangefinder. Good. Yeah, maybe not so good. A follow-up on that last one. There you go. Okay. My major feline retriever has arrived. And apparently she is at a loss. She can't spot the pigeon, which is less than 10 yards away. Now let me show you to the right. What a silly cat. Okay, let's help the cat out. There she is. Okay, this is gonna have to do it. You're welcome. Okay, one more. Wind from the left. Good. Hey, you. This one had something wrong with its wing. Oh, its mate landed right on top of it. Well, you can join him. Oh my god. That was gruesome. Well, I got the second one good. But apparently the first one is alive and it took shelter 
right over there. Okay, now let's get a quick follow-up. Okay, there he is. He is done. This one here is the leaker. And that's the follow-up. Looks like we did a lot of damage there. 64 yards. Oh, this one. Wind from the right. Boom! Okay everyone, I trust you enjoyed this video, I really hope you did. This thing performed great, the new Trilock moderator by Edgun, the behemoth. You'll be seeing more of it along with some new pieces of equipment in my next videos. Coming really soon, pest control sessions included of course. Stay tuned and catch you on the next one.